back with another one and uh that's me I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about um I went back to jail again I in my car pissing at the pet at the petrol off X3 in Kingsland in Georgia I thought I knew this woman. She she was a um what you call that a um she was an escort guy. It was not, not, she was she, she had a truck and she had a, um she escorted trucks and stuff like that. And I thought I knew the woman. <clears throat> that just showed me how deceptive women are. I thought I felt comfortable enough around the the, 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 uh, the, the you know I I had like a piss um bottle. Yeah, I piss in a bottle. I have a piss bottle, so I felt comfortable to piss around. It was Sunday, and I'm looking and, and uh, you know what? And it was a white woman too, so I was pretty much hanging myself. And one and a woman, you know, she was what 58, 59 years. Yeah, I, I, yeah. I'm gonna let I'm gonna let myself out like that. Yeah, she was fifty. She was in the late fifties. But anyway, uh, I felt comfortable. Around. She wasn't half bad for somebody that looked 58, 59 years old. But I thought I knew her, you know, because she, she fed me and which I knew it was a trap right there, I, you know. And then I just felt comfortable around her. I, I, and that just shows me how treacherous these women can be. But anyway, listen, but anyway, she talked about, hey, let's go, to, you know, get get a room and stuff like that. Um, and don't worry about my two dogs because she had two dogs, but uh. Somebody, let's get a t let's get a couple of you know let's get a room together. I'm like, um, I don't know about that. And then she, we got the room, and I mean we didn't get the room, but um, we went to the hotel. And she said she got to go get a cashier's check, and I said, uh, yeah. Some told me so I need to get the fudge on out of here. So and then I came back to the truck and stop, and here come the police waiting on me. And I went. I went to jail. Been decent exposure. I felt comfortable to piss around. I thought I felt comfortable to piss around a woman, but I made a made. I made like the most epic mistake of my life. I pissed in. I pissed in about. I pissed in my car. Now I did it in my car, and she was in her truck. But I. I, I made a mistake. I made probably I made the greatest fatal error in life. I don't care what you think about me. I made a mistake. So the fuck what? Like y'all never made no mistakes. And that's why I'm here to say why why I am a misogynist and why I hate all women altogether. But I'm also a homophobic. I also don't I also don't endorse homosexuality. Because It's bull crap. I'm I'm against it. Cause I, I I really thought since I hate women so much, what if I turned gay? And I thought about if I ever if I ever went gay, that'd be dumb too. That'd be just as bad. Why even bother with? And I'm even I'm against homosexuality because it's, it's it's not a god. And what I did wasn't a god either. But you know, the obnoxious police officer, being an egotistical prick that is, I'm going back to the story. But police officer, being an egotistical man of God, thought he was above the law, typical peck of wood, being a clan member, you know. I'm like, you know what? Fuck this. And I just came to the conclusion all white folks are like are, 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 are clan members. And I hate all of them. I hate everybody when I when it comes down to it. I'm, I just became a straight up misogynist, and I'm a homophobic type. I can't stand homosexuals either. I've, I've had to come, had to come in contact with them. They, they try to fuck you over too. They just want you to feel sympathetic towards their ass. I just don't. I thought, I thought I was, I thought about going there, but I'm not going there. I can't do that. I can't want because it ain't, it ain't of, of natural order. What does that make me? If I'm not, if I'm against homosexuality and I'm a misogynist, what does that make me? Me. 
You know, and I, I don't care. Women gave me no, made me no choice to be misogynist. I can be a misogynist, and it's not going to matter. I can get away with being a misogynist because I'm a five foot seven dude, and I'm lighter. I'm a lighter skinned black man. I'm caramel, caramelish, brownish, light brown, caramel black man, and I can get away with it. I can get away with it. Cause women hate me anyway. That meant I made a mistake. That whole, that whole experience put emphasis on why to be a more strict misogynist. To discriminate against all women no matter what age they are. No matter what race or age they are. Hate them all. And I'm not finna whine. I'm not finna go off about that. Because you, you can lay them as a fucking whine. I can give a shit. Because, you, you know, y'all want to prove my point on why to be a misogynist anyway. But that's that rant right there. But my, here's my views on homosexuality again. We're obsessed with homos. We're obsessed with the gay community. We're obsessed with homosexuality here in America. It's like, why should we feel so sorry for them? Why should we feel so sorry for homosexuals? I'm like, that's them. That's their lifestyle. As long as it don't affect me, that's their lifestyle. I really thought about it, whether, and guys, I know all you guys have really thought, am I gay or not? And that, and that kind of creeped me out. And that, if it creeped you out that much, <clears throat> then you're probably not gay. But you had to re really do some examination. I had to do some detailed examination. No, I did not do no dudes. I just really had to do in deep thought. And I said, I can't, I, I will not be one. I can't do it. That's my view on it. I had to really do, you got, you have to, I know, because that, that stuff comes up, you know, it feels creepy. But be me being another dude, I couldn't do that shit. I couldn't do it. I couldn't, I couldn't have no relationship with dudes. I, I could not, that's out of the question. Nah. But I'm done, I'm completely done with women all over the world. Women will try to con you. Women will try to fuck you over. Women will try to have power over you no matter what. Even if you try to ignore their ass, they'll try to call the police on you for nothing. I can't do it no more. Y'all, y'all, all of y'all are some have, uh, uh, some way, some form of some fashion deceptive. There's always going to be a trouble in a freaking marriage. Why? Because many women are going to see things differently and it is what it is. Okay, I have to be a misogynist, man. I can get away with it. Women wouldn't care. Black women be, be, be wouldn't give a shit. You know, I can hate your black woman ass. You wouldn't give a fuck. You could try to play. You could try to man stroke and and try to um and try to um try to sweet talk your way. White women, you know, y'all, y'all, all y'all automatic, y'all, y'all automatically hate us anyway. Pecklewood, you know, I'm done with child because I had this white dude. Now, another crazy thing, I had another, I had this white dude call me a nigga. You know, he had this dog out. I'm like, I called him a nigga right back. That's the only way to defeat him. I know my thoughts are uh, garbled, but I don't give a fuck. I really don't care. I need to learn that too. That's my rant. All I'm saying is, fellas, don't let these women screw you. And ladies, don't get what the wrong kind of want to do. Because that dude was probably raised by, that, that old no good nigga was probably raised by a single mother anyway. You know how women are. But there you go. Let me see how long. That's almost 10 minutes. There you go. I'm a misogynist and I'm a homophobic. I won't say homophobic, but I'm against homosexuality. What does that make me? Make me me. That's what I think. But, uh, 
here's my here's another thing, fellas. Don't you women or y'all are no good. Y'all are no good. I'm I'm, I'm a, y'all are no good because I'm even against my own my, my own sisters and my mama. You you fellas go on kissing these women's asses, knowing they treating you like stir fried monkey shit. You Simpson manginas out there. You self hating Simpson manginas. Y'all go right the fuck ahead and say, oh, that's your that's your. That's for that, that. That's your mother. That's your sister. I don't give a fuck if it is my mama, my, my sister. My mama, my sister called the police on me. He'll call shit. They'll call the police on your ass too. They'll fuck you over and double cross your ass too. You still love them, but they'll fuck you over too. That ain't even matter. That ain't even fucking matter, man. Doesn't matter. I and, and you know what? If, if, if a woman is kind to of me, that's God. That is straight God. That's not that woman. That is God. That's God's divineness. That's God himself stepping in. If a woman's ever kind to me. Because women don't have the ability to be kind. And I'm, just, I'm just grateful that the Afro queen, the way she is, she talks shit about me. She proved my freaking point. She put, mo- she put emphasis on why I should be a misogynist anyway. Cause she she that natural hate for me. You talking about yeah, women don't like guys that whine about do, 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 do. Women don't like me, period. No matter if I'm confident or not. I'm just I'm just uh, women hate me, and I need to learn to accept that shit. And just talk shit about women, and then not nobody care. So if some old man trying to want to come jump down my fucking throat, and make him. Feel like he's a man defending women, you know, want to jump down my throat. I'd be ready to whoop your ass, you know, want to come whoop my ass. I would be ass for being a fucking obnoxious, compulsive old CD having prick. I don't like you. I don't like you because you defend women. I don't like you because you want to be all obnoxious. What I'm saying is, don't expect nothing good out of women, ever, fellas. Be a man, make your money. That's all I'm saying. Be a man, be be the, be the, all the man you can be, and make your money, and leave these women al- leave these women alone. Hopefully, they will cancel each other out. They get with each other, cancel each other out with drama and belligerence, and then they'll miss men. Fuck them. They, w- real talk. Women like women are in love with each other. American women, anyway, especially American women. All women are in love with each other. They're better off with each other. They're better off with each other. Because they, they deceive us anyway. All I'm saying is I made a mistake associating myself with women. I'm never going to do it again. If I got to gouge my eyes out. I threw all, matter of fact, I threw away all my... I, I, I threw away um, most of my porn. I still got some most porn to throw away because it involves women. I throw them away. There you go. Women, I hate you, and I don't give a shit about you. My random rant. I'm a misogynist, and I'm homophobic. Oh, I'm a homophobic, but I'm against homosexuality. That makes me me. There you go.